Justin's music helps me figure out what the movie is going to be at its core. Damien wanted me to almost score some sequences of the movie before he shot it. He was given early drafts of the script and started figuring out what the main themes of the film would be. Damien had told me he wanted it to sound completely different than anything we've done before. So I just started playing around with some production ideas, learning to use some electronics that I've never used before, learning to play the theremin. By the time we were shooting, Justin had composed full suites of music. We have these big sequences like the moon landing. There's a huge queue full of brass. the family stuff in this movie. For me, that's the heart of it. Even when he's on the moon, I feel like his mind is at home in some ways. The theremin serves as a voice for that sacrifice and more specifically, loneliness. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Once you go to the moon, I would assume you don't come back the same person, and a part of you maybe will always be on the moon. Now, 2001 A Space Odyssey has been called the best film ever made. The Star Wars movies make up a billion dollar franchise fueled by rabid obsessive fans. Even the highest grossing film of all time, Avatar, is a sci-fi film. Yet, despite the frequent acclaim and fandom that science fiction movies attract, no sci-fi film has ever won the Academy Award for Best Picture. Hmm. Maybe in the not so distant future? <laughs>